Hey, welcome to Man Kitchen Recipes. I'm Kevin, and yeah, we tore out the grass. We're doing some more work out here. It'll go back. Anyway, so today I'm going to make some smoked Oktoberfest beer braised brats. All right, so I picked up some, uh, actually some Johnsonville beer brats while I was at the store. So we're going to get these on the Pit Boss Lexington 500 at smoke level for 30 minutes. Then we're going to do the beer braised. All right, stay tuned. I'll show you how I'm going to get this done. All right, so the first part is really difficult. Uh, I've got it at 180 degrees, and uh, we're just gonna put our brats in here. I wanna put these in here for half an hour so that they can get a nice little smoke, just at 180. All right, and then we'll be back, get them in a pan, we'll beer braise them, and uh, enjoy them. Uh, beer brats, and these are Oktoberfest beer brats. You know, uh, brats are served usually with mustard, mustard and grilled onions, mustard and sauerkraut. Some people like ketchup. You know, some people just like mustard. So I've got this uh, sweet onion diced up. And I also picked up some of this homestyle sauerkraut from the store. I taste it a little bit. It's pretty tasty. And then, uh, you know, I mean, I've got to use an Oktoberfest beer, right? Well, I'm in New Mexico. And our Santa Fe Brewing in New Mexico, in Santa Fe, New Mexico... They made an Oktoberfest beer. Ha! Huh. Go figure. It says, finally, it has arrived. A beer with crisp maltiness and delicious notes of Bavarian hops. A beer that strikes fear in soft pretzels, bratwurst, and red chili all over the world. A beer that, for some reason, is named after a holiday that actually starts in September. This is Santa Fe Oktoberfest. Not exactly authentic German Marzen-style lager, but is brewed by very authentic New Mexicans. Prost, amigos. <laughs> All right, so what I'm going to do here is uh, we're going to, I'm going to use this uh, sauerkraut because, uh, you know, it's Oktoberfest and I like sauerkraut and I like onions. So what I'm going to do is have the best of both worlds if I can get this out of the jar. Okay, so there's our sauerkraut. Let me just kind of mix it around over here spread it out in this pan this is just a little i don't even know what size it is eight by eight or something like that yep eight by eight it's not real deep we're not looking for a real deep pan uh, so what i'm going to do is we're going to add this sauerkraut i'm going to add the onions in here and then when those uh, bratwursts are smoked which they're in the pellet grill right now but when they got a nice uh, layer of smoke on them we're gonna lay them in this bed of onions and sauerkraut and Oktoberfest. New Mexican Oktoberfest beer. I know, hey, what can I say? I wonder if they made it with green chilies. I doubt it. I thought about putting some green chili in here, but I'll spare y'all. We're not gonna put uh, green chilies, but we are using an Oktoberfest beer. And that looks like enough so that I get to uh, you know, take the last few swallows out of that can, okay? So as soon as those brats are ready, we're laying them in here. We'll cover it with foil and we'll braise them. And uh, yeah, can't wait to try these out. All right, it's been about 45 minutes on the smoke. I came out here after 30 and uh, turned them over. They weren't quite uh, colorful enough for me. So what I'm gonna do now is, since I already have my sauerkraut onions and Oktoberfest beer in here, this is where I told you I'm just going to uh, set these brats in here. And we're gonna get a beer braise going. And the beer is also gonna be with my brats and my onions. All right. We'll do that, we're gonna cover it with foil. I'm gonna turn my pit boss up to uh, 300 and yeah, 325 degrees and we're gonna let this go for probably about 30 minutes. I'll check them. They'll probably be done It's not gonna you know they're brats. Uh, you just want to get the internal temp up to 160 and uh, Yeah, then we'll build some bratwurst and Give them a taste test. We got 40 minutes uh, 325 Pull this out See what We're looking at They're brazen. Look at that bubbling of the uh, beer in there. All right. Now we're gonna have to take a uh, 
temp check. I always hate the uh, poking brats or any kind of sausages, but sometimes you gotta sacrifice one. Let's sacrifice this one right here. Oh yeah, 190. We are done. Just gonna make sure that you know you're not undercooking your sausages. So uh, yeah, let's go build one of these and give it a taste. Let's get some in here. Let's see inside. All right, these uh these, these look pretty amazing. Uh, got some smoke on them for about 45 minutes. I uh, added onion to my sauerkraut and. Uh, Oktoberfest, New Mexican Oktoberfest beer. Uh, smells amazing. So let me uh, get one set up here. Oh, let me just slide this back. It's pretty hot, so. <clears throat> All right, so instead of using a regular hot dog bun, I mean, I have hot dog buns, but uh, the hot dog buns, to me, when you make brats, are just too small. So just use a sub roll. Um, nice, fresh sub roll. All right, so for this Oktoberfest beer braise brats, I am going to add uh, some mustard because I love mustard dogs and I love mustard on my brats. We won't skimp on it. Okay, then I'm going to add one of my brats. And this is why I like using a better uh, bun. Everything will fit. In a hot dog bun, you would be pressed and you wouldn't be able to get all these delicious ingredients. Get some of the onions, get some of the sauerkraut in there, some of the beer drippings. All right, and there you go. Smoked Oktoberfest beer braise bra. All right, let's take this outside and give this there a taste. Oktoberfest smoked beer braised bra. In a hoagie roll or a sub roll what do you want to call it i am using the sauerkraut and onion and mustard all three you know toppings whatever you like on your brats <laughs> well that first bite was all bread <laughs> the brat slid back when i went to bite into it okay here we go again <laughs> with the with the brats and the onions in it, it just wants to slide right out. So let's try that one more time and get some of that brat. I got a little bit of that one. Mmm, yeah, juicy. Wow. Whoops, uh, there's the brat. Pretty tasty brat. It's just a Johnsonville brat, nothing special. <clears throat> Johnsonville beer brat. All right, so uh, the sauerkraut, onions, and uh, beer that was in there really came out great. It's not super sour. If you're afraid that you don't like sauerkraut, give it a try. Mix it with onions, mix it with beer, throw your brats in there. I'm telling you, it's very tasty. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> All right, well, I'm going to go ahead and enjoy this. Um, uh, Thanks for watching this. I hope you make some uh, bratwurst during Oktoberfest. Have an Oktoberfest beer. I left mine inside. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe. And hey, we'll see you uh, on the next video, I hope. Have a great day.